Hi scholars, welcome back. Let's work on our spelling today. Today we'll be doing our interactive writing practice. This is module two, cycle six, lesson 28. Materials. You'll need paper and pencil today so that you can write out our words. Here are our learning targets. The first one says, I can read, identify the syllable type, and spell words with our controlled vowels. The second learning target says, I can write a sentence using words with the spelling patterns O-R, A-R, I-R, E-R, and U-R. Transition song! Can you take a closer look, a closer look, a closer look? Can you take a closer look at these words today? Word work. We'll be looking at some two-syllable words. You can see this first one here. In red, it's showing that R-controlled sound. O-R says or. We'll underline our R-controlled syllable in red. And we'll underline the other syllable in blue. You can see that that's a closed syllable. The D, or the consonant, is closing in that vowel, making a short vowel sound. That word says forbid. Forbid. Let's try the next one together. Here's the word. There's our first syllable, which is closed again. And our second syllable, which has that R controlled sound. That word says transform. Transform. Nice job. I want you to try this one. Look at that R controlled sound. ER says er. The first syllable is closed. And that second syllable is R controlled. Snap out the word. What is it? Pattern. Pattern. Great work. Here's the next one. That first syllable is closed and that second syllable is our R controlled sound. What's the word? Whimper. Nice. Here's the next one. This first syllable is closed and that second syllable is R controlled. What does it say? Antler, antler. Good reading. Here's the next one. Go ahead and look for the syllables. Closed and R controlled. What's this word? Disturb. Wow. Try another one. Here's our first closed syllable and our second R controlled syllable. What's the word? Suburb. Nice one. Try this one. A closed syllable first, and IR is making our R controlled ER sound in the second syllable. What's the word? Confirm. You're a great reader. Transition song. Do you know the words we'll write? The words we'll write? The words we'll write? Do you know the words we'll write on our paper today? Writing. You'll need your paper and pencil so that we can spell out some words with the R controlled sounds. Quickly remind yourself, OR says OR. AR says R. E-R-I-R -R and U-R 
all make the er sound. Try to write out each of these words on your paper. The first word is bird. Listen to that er sound and write it out. B, er, d. Spell it with me. B, I, R, D. I, R is making our er sound. Try this one. It's the word shark. Tap it out to help you spell it. Go ahead. Let's check it. Sh, R, K. Spell it with me. S, H, A, R, K. A, R is making the R sound. This is the word fork. Tap it out and spell it on your paper. Fork. I heard or in the middle. F or k. Spell it with me. F O R K. Great spelling. Now you'll have a chance to write a silly sentence using those three R controlled words we just spelled bird, shark, fork. Start with a capital letter and remember to end with punctuation. I'll give you a moment to write your silliest sentence. Be creative. Go ahead. Tap out your words to check your spelling. Remember to use the words bird, shark, fork. I can tell you've come up with something silly. Couple more seconds to finish it. Five, four, three, two, one. Pencils down. Here's the sentence I came up with. The bird poked the shark with a fork. Isn't that silly? Can you imagine that happening? Notice I started with my capital letter and I ended with a period. I used my R controlled sounds to help me spell the words bird, shark, and fork. I'm sure your sentence is just as good. Thanks for sharing. Closing reflection. How did you take responsibility for your learning today? Which R controlled spelling pattern was a bit tricky? I bet that E-R-I-R-U-R -R -R pattern was the trickiest. It's confusing to have three different ways to spell one sound. Try writing more sentences with R controlled words to make a silly story. Thanks for joining me today. I'll see you next time.